All right, so we just finished the inside here of the small barn, and I found on Craigslist this U-shaped dog kennel, which is perfect for putting the, the goats in, the does in. I can divide it up later when they kid. And right there is gonna be a spot to keep the billy in when he can't be with the does. And then right here is gonna be a pen for farrowing. Um, I hope it's not too small. I'm um, gonna have to maybe put a corner brace in or something to give the pig piglets room to escape, but I'm gonna just try this. I'm doing the best I can with the space I have. And there's another spot there for the uh, sow. What I did was in my shop, I had a bunch of leftover concrete board uh, and I wanted to get it out of there to clean it out anyways. And I wanted to put it on the walls to help protect the walls from pig manure. And then over here is just a spot for the boar uh, when he's not living with the sows. So we managed to get the power in. I just used some two foot uh, LED strips. It's all insulated now. There are plugs for heat lamps for the piglets. And then out here, uh, my friend Joe helped. He's a great electrician. Made this all look really nice. And uh, we put in a shop light there and then four foot LED strips there and a power plug over there for the uh, electric fence. Right here, we put in a plug to put the stock tank. And you can see my stock tank heaters there. I'm gonna ground that, which is gonna be a separate video. I have to order a four foot grounding rod. I don't want the cows to get shocked. I had the metal cable wire left over in the shop. You'll see that I use that any place I think the cows might get to it. Obviously, I don't want them getting a shock. Uh, and I did the best they could to secure it and make sure that metal boxes are used and just as safe as possible. So anyways, that's the small barn update. As of right now, um, some animals can come in here and I'm basically ready for winter. Other than heat in here, which is its own separate issue and I'm gonna be working on that in the next few weeks. So that's my idea as to how to build a small barn. We'll see how well it works.